Yeah, more sell praises and all that you have. Bar Shem, Bar Shem, Bar Shem, Bar Shem, And double others to the apostles and elders of Braveland Stone. Shall I want to all my brothers and mothers pushing straight in our sincerity and our honesty. You know, and this is a brother from James Jamaica Camp. Um, Yashamai. Ashar. I war. Shaar. I know all my listen, you know, and um, uproars, you know, will take place you now. Yeah, Netherlands, yeah. you have um, uproar you now over this whole um, it's a queer few thing, you know, and hey, these, these things are part of, you know, Bible prophecy because scripture speak about these things that will take place, right? And we know, say, hey, soon in America, right? Because these things have to happen, and they're going to happen in America, you know, for a, for a, wide, for a broad scale, and, right? You've been seeing a little here and there in America from, from last year. Mm -hmm. From the whole um, BLM and them stuff there. And them, you know, we all know those things were, were actually, um, 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 what do I say, um, no, false flag. As I would have pushed out, um, agent provocateurs have pushed all them stuff. But mm -hmm. the real shit is gonna come, man. Eh? But see? I used to, I used to try to basically you know, get the people to come up against you know, the whole, come up against the state <laughs> so you know, they can't justify themselves. You know, the pass certain law, but God. you know, a lot of our people, them on a deep sleep, say, hard to get them to basically um, um, raise up them. Mm -hmm. And I suppose say, who, who shall rise him up? Who shall rise him up? Genesis, right? Yeah, go on, brother. This is um, it's an article from RT News, published 25th 20, of January 2021. It says, um, unrest erupts in Dutch cities um, for a third, third night in a, in a row in pushback against um, COVID curves or COVID curves. Mm -hmm. So people basically um, I get fed up with the whole lockdown thing now. Because that get to them head, man. Because people depress, distress upon people and all of that, man. It says, um, says anti-lockdown riots have broken out for the third consecutive night in the Netherlands with um, fires lit, police vehicles burned. And, and windows smashed. Police have a vow to crack down on the lawlessness. It says, hours after Dutch Prime Minister Mark Root um, can condemn two days of anti lockdown riots as criminal violence and, and vow to keep a controversial curfew in place, disgruntled citizens took to the streets again for another night of meme. Mm -hmm. See? Yeah, so, so, so basically, the, the, the Prime Minister said, man, man, bring forth some curfews because of the whole lockdown where they're going. But people, people don't give a damn, man. Because as scripture, scripture tells you, man, see, scripture tells you, there shall be sedition among men. They're not going to regard them kings, they are them princes, man. See? And the course of them actually are going to be in a what? The moon court. Second Ezra 8 verse 62 so, um, so these things have I shown have I not shown unto all men but unto thee right? and a few like thee then answered I and said behold O Lord thou hast showed me a multitude of wonders which thou will begin to do in the last times. Oh God, but, right, man. but at what time thou hast not um, showed me? When we go to um, 2 Ezra 9 and verse, verse 1 said, He answered me then and said, Measure the time thou dil diligently in itself. God. So we so what? Measure the time diligently in itself. You know, read um, Ecclesiastes um, 3 and verse 1. He said, There's a time and a season. So for everything on the on the base call it heavens. I will leave that the time of the time of the third words were destruction. The time of um upwards of the people, you know, and all these things because these things are about about prophecy as I mentioned. Right? So much of the time thou diligent in itself. <coughs> and when thou seest part of a sign pass which I have told thee before, then shall thou understand that it is the time, it is the very same time, where the highest will begin to visit the world which he made. So you see all these things, you know, all these um, prophecies are come to pass, then you are going to understand, mm -hmm. you see, you live in time, 
for the Lord Yahweh and Bashim Yahushai to visit the world which he made. We live now the time of our um, second coming of the Lord Yahushai. Right? We live now the time of the judgment of this wicked society. <coughs> judgment that he saw here. <coughs> right? Go on. Um, it says the very same time when the eyes will begin to visit the world which he made. Right. Therefore, when there shall be seen um, earthquakes and uproars of the people in the world. Like what takes place now. You know, you have a lot of uproars now uh, um, taking place. Like even in um, the Netherlands, as the bread are going to the article early on, with the whole curfew, curfew thing. You know, people get upset about the whole curfew thing. You know. So it's a part of the you know, Bible prophecy, right? Go on. Then shall no will understand that the most I speak of those things from the days that were before thee, God even from the beginning. The most I speak of those things, because all these things are part of prophecy, right. a part of the script, because this is your how, this is your how movie, right? right? And we are basically, uh, we, are, we, are, we, are, we, are, we are part of the script, and all these things, this is taking place a part of the script, we are living out the script, because this was pre everything was predestined according to the scripture. Uh, give me um, Isaiah, brother, Isaiah um, 46. I'll start at verse 8, I think. Isaiah 46. Verse Isaiah 46, verse 8, he said, Remember this and show yourself men. What? Bring it again to, to mind, O ye transgressors. Bring it again to mind, ye transgressors. One. Remember the former things of old. So it's how people are supposed to remember now when they start to live in it. Remember the former things of old. Yeah. Was written for our learning. Yeah. For I am your power and there is none else. One. I am Yahweh and there is none like me. There is none like our power. What? Declaring the end from the beginning. So Heavenly Father, Yahweh Hashem Yashai, declaring the end from the beginning because everything was predestined you know by your how wash me and shall take place so the whole uproar and all these things that have been happening over the years even what happened last year starting from from last year january 20 with this whole world war three thing will kick off you know right. with um them kill um the, the, the top general from iran all these things are part of you know the script you know the clearing the end from the beginning. So the Father said, declaring the end from the beginning. What? And from ancient times, the things that are not yet done. Can. Saying, My counsel shall stand, and I will do all my pleasure. Can. So, I say what? All, all um, in a Revelation, bring out Revelation for me now, brother. Revelation um, 4 and verse 11. And the brother can go back to the scripture. Alright, say, Revelation 4. Verse 11. Verse 11. One. So thou art worthy, o, o Yahweh, to receive glory and honor Can. and power, for thou art created all things, and for thy pleasure they are, they oh, are and were created. So everything was created for the Heavenly <laughs> Father, Yahweh, Bashmir, Shai, pleasure. You know, both the good and the evil. This is a how movie. Right? Go on, brother, back to the scripture. Second Ezra 9, verse 4. Go on. Then shall thou well understand that the most I speak of those things from the days that were before thee. From the days that were before us, God. Even from the beginning. Even from the beginning. As far um, like as all that is that is made in the world are the beginning and an end, and the end is manifest. Yes. Now we can clearly see who did the end. You know, based on the things that we see happening right now, we know we will live. We live at the time at the end of this empire. The end of this age, right? End of this kingdom. These are the prophecies and all the things that we see happening. I can't what the scripture says. Then you are going to understand, right? So the most I speak of these things, you know, from the from, from the beginning. So these things are going to happen. The how shall I even go back two thousand years ago? That quote from the scripture, right? When the disciple asked him, what will happen? They can't bring it on. This is Matthew 24. And verse 3. And as he sat upon the Mount of Olives, the disciples came unto him privately, saying, privately, saying, Tell us when shall these things be? And what shall be the signs 
of thy coming and the end of the world. What shall be the signs of thy coming, of the Lord's coming? Yeah, how shall you know the man of people ignorant called Jesus and the end of the world, the end of this age, the end of this kingdom? Amen. Go on. Um, give my verse then. It's, um, verse 5, verse 6, I'm talking about. And ye shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. Go on. See then, see that ye be not troubled. Go on. For all these things must come to pass, but all, the end is not yet. All these things must come to pass. <clears throat> but, right? And, not and the end is not yet. Because you still have certain more prophecies to come through. Right. To main prophecy, you know, we are looked to basically come to pass right now. Because the RFID microchip, which is the mark of the beast, become mandatory worldwide, you know, and World War Three, you know, which is basically kick start, you know, in the Middle East. Like right. two main prophecies we are looking to basically come to pass right now. Go ahead. For a nation shall rise up against nation, God. and kingdom against kingdoms, and there shall be famine and pestilence and earthquake in diverse places. God. I will see them speaking about famine this year. You know, you win. So, uh, 2020, 2021, when you have famine, you will be called for portion. Right? So, all these are the beginning of sorrows. All these will be taking place. And from last year, coming to this time, it's the beginning of sorrow. Not really start yet. That's the beginning of what to come. Because you have Esau, you know, have some serious diseases. You know, them, them love, you know, what they to release in the time to come. Because it's just people come. pestilence. Mm -hmm. right. See, you have way more worse of things there ahead yeah. before we go through. That way, it's at a place now. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. All of them things that we are seeing at the beginning yeah, of South Africa, guess what? When you have a shy come, that would be great as well. Because the, the amount that the scripture said, um, uh, the Lord will stay from, from one end of the earth and even unto the other. And so, so, all of these things we have gone, when you look, know, it will get worse gradually, gradually. Right? Then you know, yes, built up yet, until the house shall come, then it will be great. Because when the chariots burst, you know, it will be a different brand of fire. Alright? Right. You know, so. Second Ezra 15, it says, Behold, speak the only ears of my people the words of prophecy, um, words of prophecy which I will put in thy mouth, saith the Lord. Basically, as we are speaking, it's prophecy, man. Let us jump to um, verse 14. Um, and and, and we got to the scripture, say, um, Blessed are your eyes, for you will see. You know what I mean? Because many desire to see the things that we are sitting there. Right? Even the prop all the prophets are back there, you know. Yeah. Not flesh. Right? Reincarnation. Yeah, reincarnation. Yeah. Okay. You know what I mean? But a lot of men desire to see the things that we see, man. We're we, 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 we privileged, we're good, we, you know, we, we've been blessed. You know what I mean? We're glad that yeah. Yahweh Bashim has shown these things unto us. We get the spiritual eye, man. Yeah. So, as we just say, we have a, as, as men of the Lord, we have to put up the real nature of the God, mm -hmm. this one. Through, these, through, these, through the prophecies of the book, in, uh, the Lord I tell me these things so, yeah. and, and we, are, we are strengthened, these things, we are, we are strengthened ourselves, man. So you say, you know, we come up and we yeah. are like, we yeah. yeah. work for it, because, the Lord is willing, as I said, right. because, because, you know, we've been going through these things for years, right. you know what I mean, and, you know, the Lord I, I, I suck with him, with him, with him chosen, you know, so, you know, so, the Lord is willing, we continue, you know what I mean? Yeah, push this, push this truth and you know, teach this truth. You know, come up on us and away. Okay. The scripture says. It says, yeah. um, it says, Go to the world and them that dwell therein. For the sword and their destruction draw it nigh. Yeah. And one people shall stand up to fight against another. See? And swords in their hands. Yeah. See? For there shall be sedition among men and invading one another. They shall not regard their kings nor their princes. And the course of their actions shall stand in their power. See? Just like how we already had the plan that tell us that the, 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 the Prime Minister of um, the Netherlands, the past curfew laws, the controversial curfew laws, the people have still come out. Come do what they do, man. So it's a basic kind of scripture tell us that the, the, the time I come where people now regard with, 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 them, with them Prime Minister and President want to say, man. You could not bring out you could not bring out too much of national guards out there on the street, too much of police. I will bring out the people them still I will come out come do them after the because guess what the Lord I will put that spirit on them man see for them do it see man I will come out armed and ready to fight against the military man I will say what you put out here on the street there's um 
It says, For there shall be sedition. It says, a man, shall, a man shall desire to go into a city and shall not be able. For because of your pride, the city shall be troubled and the houses shall be destroyed and men shall be afraid. See? A man shall have no pity upon his neighbor, but shall destroy your houses with the sword and spoil your goods because of the lack of bread and for great tribulation. Yeah. Exactly. And I break down. <coughs> and I got nobody at child to hold a peace. Can't. Yeah. Can't. No more peace keepers, man. I was seeing these things, you know, um, um, prepared basically to take place in full effect because a wow, level of chaos will take place in a time to come. So people say, when your house, by the time your house shine, you know, make him a rifle. So people say, nevertheless, when the Son of Man come, shall he find faith on the earth because a lot of people will lose faith. You know, we hope and pray, you know, we continue, you know, on this path. See, because you must say uh, every man work and get tested. All of us going to get tested. Right? So these things that we are going through in time to come going to test us, test us all here. Right? So we hope, you know, we continue on this part until the end. Right? You must say, either end one to the end, the same shall be seen. Right? So that I say our praises and honor to you, Bashi, 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 And double honors to the apostles and elders of great men's stone. Shalom to all our brothers and more people who push this truth in our sincerity and our honesty. Shalom. Shalom. Shalom.